Kamusta? Ready ka na ba para sa lesson natin ngayong week? Welcome to our math class. Before we start, here are some reminders. I-ready ang iyong ball pen, answer sheet, at ang iyong module. Basahin at tunawain maigi ang instructions sa bawat learning task. Iwasang magusot, madumihan, mapunit, at higit sa lahat ang mawala ang iyong module. Magpagabay lamang kay Lamami, Daddy, Ate, Kuya, o kung sino mang nakatatanda sa iyo. Ikaw pa rin dapat ang sasagot sa bawat learning task. Huwag kalimutang isulat ang pangalan at section sa iyong answer sheets. Pwedeng ipos ang video para mas mabasa o maunawaan mo ang instructions. Kung may tanong, gaya nga ng sabi ng Lola ni Cardo, huwag mahihiyang magtanong. Last week, pinag-aralan natin yung tungkol sa fraction. This week, ang pag-aaralan naman natin ay ang Addition and Subtraction of Similar and Dissimilar Fraction and Solving Routine and Non-Routine Word Problems. At the end of this lesson, you're expected to solve routine and non-routine problems involving addition and subtraction of fractions using appropriate problem-solving strategies and tools. To start with our lesson, let us look at this problem. Mario painted his doghouse using 5 6 liter of yellow paint and 2 thirds liter of red paint. What color of paint was used more than the other? Gagamitin ulit natin ang mga steps in solving word problems. Una, understand. What is asked in the problem? paint color that was used more than the other. Given 5 6 liter of yellow paint and 2 thirds liter of red paint. Next step is to plan. Para mas maintindihan natin, pwede tayong gumamit ng illustration. Kagaya nito. 5 6. Next, operation. Subtraction ang gagamitin natin para sa word problem na ito. Next, number sentence. 5 6 minus 2 thirds equals n since hindi pa natin alam yung answer. Then, we will solve. Since the similar fraction sila, hahanapin mo natin ang LCD ng 6 and 3. Ang kanilang LCD is 6. I-divide natin ito sa denominator, then multiply sa numerator. 6 divided by 6 is 1. Tapos, multiply natin sa 5, kaya magiging 5, 6. Yung 2 thirds naman. 6 divided by 3 is 2. Times 2 is 4. Kaya, magiging 4, 6. Ngayon, pwede tayo mag-subtract. I-subtract lang natin ang numerators, then copy natin ang denominator. 5 minus 4 is 1. Then copy natin ang denominator, 6. So, mas nagamit ang yellow paint. Learning task 1 sa page 29. Read each problem and then solve. Write your answers on the answer sheet provided. Learning task 2 sa page 29 pa rin. Read and solve the following problems. Learning task 3, read and solve each problem sa page 29 pa rin. Sana ay naunawaan mo ang lesson natin ngayong week. See you next week!